thank you for joining me. It is Wednesday morning. Welcome back to the show. Uh, before I get started, um, well, I say before I get started, as I'm starting, should I say? Uh, I just want to thank everybody for the last video I did. Um, the comments that I got uh, really helped. Really appreciate everybody's support. Uh, it means a hell of a lot. Um, I just want to let everyone know that I am in a better place now. All good. So let's crack on with these videos. We have got a busy day today. We are going to Colchester first. No, I'm lying, we're not going to Colchester first. We've got to go to the docks, pick up a box, bring it back here, Tilbury Docks. So I'm going to DP World, then coming back here to Tilbury. And once I've done that, I'm then going back to DP World to go to Colchester, and then Colchester back to the docks, and then docks to Sittingbourne. Now, don't worry, if you don't follow, it's okay. We'll get there. We'll get there eventually. Probably indicate it's early. Leave me alone. Not that there's anyone around, but hey ho. So let's crack on and get this show on the road. I'll catch you guys when I get a little bit closer to the docks. So here we are at the docks. Looking for Bay 18. Let's go. This guy in front has been going very slow and it's really annoying me, I'm not gonna lie. I mean the slow and then there's you. You. Uh, 22, 21, 20, 19, 18. Here, I one lorry on now, and we got a few lanes free. Okay, that's good, 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 good. Spin right around. Whee. Get nice and lined up. The window to make it a little bit easier. Not the best, not the worst. Uh, just over the line and stop. When you're up. Turn it all off. Oh, health and safety gear. Lovely. One sec, be right back. A little bit strange. Uh, the light didn't come on. Um, but the crane wanted me to operate. Yeah, whatever. Doesn't make sense to most people, so it doesn't really matter. Anyway, we're going to uh, see boxes off. We're gonna go and get a box on now and take it down to Tilbury Docks and come back here again. And get on our way to Colchester. The Colchester one is a 20 foot box, I believe, full of bricks. Bricks, 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 bricks. So that should be fun. They came here the other day and uh, they just made that roundabout and the uh, shunters here in the docks, their um, trailers have got steer axles on them and I see one of the shunters going round it and pretty much wipe out one of these concrete bollards that sort of makes the roundabout. Yeah, not good, not good. It's quite amusing though, I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, the, you see that their wheels they turn. He's on. No, you're there. There we go. 
so yeah well oh is that for dock 30 it is isn't it oh no they're on 29 so that's the one i want 30 the end one now don't really want to be Any lanes free? Just the end lane. Geese is going to be in my way. Oh dear, never mind. We'll figure it out. Right, so it's enough of that head cam stuff. Thought you might want to see my pretty face now for a change. Uh, we are heading out of the docks now. Got my box on. And then we're going to head to Tilbury. To Tilbury. And get that off. And come back here again. I love it, yeah. Now, nah, to be fair, it's not that cool. Jesus, that sun. It's not that bad, yeah. It's been good lately. I've had a lot of luck with um, the, the lanes, not today, but in the past, so usually you'll get like, today I've got an 18, which is all the way down here, when you have to come back, get on 30, and then go all the way back out, to come all the way back out again, which is a bit of a ball ache. But, the past couple of weeks, I've had a lot, a lot, can't speak today. I've had a lot of luck in terms of I've had my box off and on on the same lane, so lane 20, on and off, go. But when you get that once today where you're on a, off at 18 and then you want to go to 30, it's, it's a lot of messing about, it's just a little bit inconvenient should we say. Don't know if I'm going to be able to. Beetlejuice all over me bloody screen. Can't see Jack. No, oh, what is the time? Time is. Discussion. Time is 5.45 and I've got to be back here between 6 and 7 so I need to get back to Tilbury, get this box off and get back within an hour and 15 minutes. It's going to be tight. <laughs> See how we get on. Catch you in a sec. Righty ho, we are here back at Tilbury Docks going to get this box off. Literally just inside here. I go up to the roundabout, turn right, and it's literally just on the left. Morning. Just give the security guards this wave in the morning. Twisty locks. And I'm not complaining that he's not there right away. However, if he's not there in five minutes, we've got a problem. Oh, not be happy, I tell ya. Undo the twisty locks. Do, 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 do. Go. Oh, 
And now we gotta wait for him to come take the box. Another job jumped. Time to get back to the docks. It's 20 past six. We've got 40 minutes to get there. Plenty of time. It takes about 15 minutes to get there from here. So no need to panic. Uh, guys, you let me go. Thank you, thank you. Oh, it's, it's Wayne, Wayne, is it Wayne? Oh, mine's all blank. Russell, Jesus, Wayne, fuck's Wayne. Wayne's world, Wayne's world. <laughs> anyway, catch you back in the dog. So I've just had a little look on Google Mappies and we're going to a stone yard, Global Stone to be precise, just off the A120 up near Colchester Way. Uh, so that should be interesting. And it's down a tight little country lane. Well, I say it's down a tight little country lane, it's, it's off of the main road down about half a mile, <laughs> if that, a quarter of a mile uh, to get to this stone yard. So yeah. I mean, it should be suitable for lorries because yeah, they've got to get a delivery, don't they? So we'll, we'll see how it goes when we get there. Right. Let's get our ticket. Find out what lane we've got. What lane we've got? 17. And I've got to set out for a 20 foot box, so don't forget to remind me. I've got to set out for a 20 foot box. Maybe I can even show you how. Let's do this. See you in a bit. Right, so it's time for a little education, guys. If you know how to do this, feel free to skip forward a little bit. But if you don't and you want to know, here we go. So, we've got our trailer, like so. At a moment, we've got these ones up. We don't need these ones up because we're going to have a 20 foot trailer on a container. So, we're going to want this one here, just like so. These two middle ones that are together stay down, and this one goes up. Right, so now this is a thing where people uh, do a lot, which they shouldn't. So, if we look down here, we've got the pin that's in there, but it should be in here for a 20 foot position. Now, you can fit it on either way. It will fit, it doesn't matter. However, if you get pulled over by the DVLA and it's in the wrong position, they can find you because it just affects the weight distribution a little bit or something like that, I don't know. It is, yeah, one of those things. So you are supposed to have it in slot two. So in a minute, I'll do that. Uh, I'll put this down as well. And then what we're gonna do is and latch this. Okay. Put these over. Right? The reason we put these over is when we get to our job, 
because it's a 20 foot container we have to shrink down the skeleton so if you can see the body here the body slides all the way back so the doors will be at the actual back of the trailer and that way they can access it what they'll do is they'll probably put a ramp on it when I'm going so same principle this side this one's a little stiff line to be down for a second So yeah, same principle. There we go. So one, two, three, four. Back onto down. So when I squash it down, it's not going to have a problem. And then ah, done. Scan our card. So that's all done there. It's all uh, squashed down to the right position that it's supposed to be in. And now we just got to issue wait for our box as usual. And then we're going to head off to this new place in Colchester. So stay tuned and I shall see you there. Right. So that's it, box is on. It's got twist locks, as normal. There's nothing really different, other than obviously the, the little bits that I've showed you. The principle is pretty much the same. Do uh, all our twist locks up. And get out of here. Catch you in a sec. Right, so first things first, what we need to do is put the trailer brake on, pull that out, and then we are going to, see this pin here, stick it out, we want to pull this button, or push it in this case, and then that should retract, well, it's not at the moment, but when I give it a little wiggle because it's stuck on the actual, you know, that will go in and then we'll be able to squish it down. So, let's do this. So we're backed up onto the ramp and there's two guys unloading me, which usually I'd say, great, but I need a break. So I'm probably gonna get 15 minutes in here. <laughs> and I'm probably gonna have to go somewhere else and get another half an hour in, which is a little bit inconvenient. But hey ho, that is part of the job. There is that. He's dropping them off there for the other guy. And he's coming along and taking them. So yeah, I'm gonna be here for probably about 15 minutes if I'm lucky. And then we're gonna head back. Hopefully get back before I need a break. And then we can get down to Sittingbourne as soon as possible. Catch you in a second. Righty, 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 everybody. We are all done here. Um, trailer's all stretched back out. Trailer brake's still on. 
So we need to go turn that off before we go in here because we're not gonna get far with that. And then, yeah, we're gonna head back to the docks. So let's do this. Righty ho, let's go. Let's just let everybody know that we're moving. A little honk. Before you go, thank you very much, sir. See you later. And now we've got to try and remember. Oh, yeah, it was left. We came from left, it was. Yeah. Let's do this. Oh, there's a car coming that way, and there's a lorry coming down that way. Now uh, we're going to get past here. Nice and tight. Thank you, sir. Thank you for waiting for me. Uh, back to the A12 and then make her sweet her sweet back. Oh, thank you, sir. And yeah, we're just gonna sit in traffic now until we get to the A12. So I'll catch you uh, when we get a little bit further back. And that was fun and interesting, wasn't it, getting out of there? <laughs> Uh, this is the joys of being a truck driver sometimes. Oh, hang about, hang about, are we moving? What's going on? No, we're not. Right, see you in a sec. Hello guys, welcome to the channel. Thank you for joining me. So, there's a little quick message I just wanted to get across to everybody. I'm so appreciative of all the support that I get for this channel and I couldn't do it without your support. Um, so I've made a little website where I'm selling a few t-shirts and jumpers as a few people have asked in the past um, So if you want to show your support head over to the link in the description below www.truckitproud.com And you can find yourself some t-shirts a bit like this one This one's actually not for sale on there at the moment, but if you like it, let me know and I can make that happen um, So yeah uh, basically, anything that I make from the profits of these sales will literally be chucked straight back into my YouTube channel. Anything that I need, like cameras, etc., etc., etc. I'm not doing this for profit. I'm doing this purely because I like making YouTube videos and I want to make the best content that I possibly can for you guys. So. If you haven't subscribed, make sure you uh, hit that subscribe button. Hit us a like as well, because that gets the video up there and out there to everyone else. And I hope to see you guys on the next video. Thank you very much for watching. I appreciate you. All the best.